I wanted to make a quick video just talking about 10 times and and why you shouldn't pull for them because I I still can't believe like just how many people are pulling shards on 10 times events like you can see right now there's a 10 times going on for sacreds voids and ancients and even though I have 79 ancient shards I'm not going to be using them because it's a scam. It's a complete scam system. It doesn't work anymore. It, it, I heard it's a good system in the past, but that was before I had started even playing. So I can't speak too much on that. But just now, knowing what I know now, I know that it's not a good system. And the reason for that's pretty simple. It's just because there's too many legendaries in the game right now where even if it's a 10 times chance it's just not enough it's not enough to warrant pulling on the 10 times just because there's too many legendary champions in the game and you can see here like here's Leorius and Dracomorph I could use these champions like these would be really good champions for me but it's just not worth the risk to me because I've seen so many videos of like content creators you know just pulling thousands of shards even and they don't get the champion that's on the 10 times so there's really only a few cases which you should pull on a 10 times the first one is if you have to to complete a fusion like right now we have the fusion going for a pardon if I can find him uh, okay here he is so if you have to pull on it 10 times to complete a fusion that's different that would be acceptable to do And um, the other case would be if you have pretty much every legendary champion except for maybe just a few. So really this is just for whales, but if you have like, you know, every or even most legendary champions except a few. Like let's, let's say, you know, I didn't have Leorius. And I had, you know, 95% of the other uh, Void Legendaries. Then you could make an argument, okay, it's, it's probably worth it then. Because, you know, I want to get Lororius. He's the last one that I need. Then you could say, yeah, it's, it's worth it then to pull on it 10 times. But other than those two cases, never. It's never, never, never going to be worth it. And the other reason is because on a 10 times, you can see here, like, for a 2 times, you're going to be getting double the chance of epics as well. And you don't want to figure out epics because there's a lot of really good epics in the game. So, like, for Ancient Shards, you know, uh, I'd be getting a 16% chance of getting epics as well. And so you can't forget about that either. Whereas with this, so 10 times, that's going to be the same. So you're not going to get as many epics either. And you're not going to get as many legendaries. Like, yeah, it kind of sucks with the two times. You don't know what you're getting, right? You could just get a bunch of Pixneels. So it is still RNG, but I'd, I'd rather take my chances with that than you know, a 0.5% chance to get a legendary on a 10 times. It's just way too low of a chance. And then even if you do get, pull a legendary, it's, it's still not a good chance even to get the 10 times one that you are after. 
So I would say even if it's like no matter what champion it is, even if it's, you know, Chris, Duchess, Siffy, Warlord, whoever it is, it's just not worth it because it's just such a low chance to actually get them. And this goes for pretty much any of the other events, I would say. Though, the other events are a little bit better, I would say. Like the double legendary one, they've done that pretty recently, where you pull one legendary and you get another one. The, I mean, it's still two times is always going to be the best. Until they change things, two times is the best, in my opinion, anyway. Um, but I would say ten times is definitely the worst one. Like, even the, the double legendary one just sounds a whole lot better. Or, what's the other one they've done? The guaranteed champ ones. Those, those are pretty good too. But, I still would suggest not to do those ones. And, mainly just because those are never going to be a top tier legendary that they're going to put in there. It's just going to be somebody you know, maybe good, but not great, or like not a top tier champion, really. So it's, you're going to be getting a good champion, but it's somebody that could be replaced, most likely. And do you really want to like spend 100 shards or whatever, just getting a champion you're eventually going to replace? So that's pretty much all I have to say about that. Don't pull on 10 times. It's not worth it. Um, they did actually bait me once. One time they baited me, and I pulled six Void Shards for a Krisk. I didn't get them, obviously. And I'll never fall for it again, hopefully. But it's really... It's really frustrating to even see other people doing it. And then... And not getting what they, they wanted. And these are the kind of people that you're going to see on the forums saying they're quitting, th that they've been playing for, you know, a year or two years, and they've only got a few legendaries, and this is going to be why.